Scene Script Have you ever wondered what invisible forces might be affecting your health every time you step outside? It's not the latest science fiction plot, but a real, everyday occurrence. The culprit, ultraviolet, or UV rays. When we think of UV rays, our minds typically jump to the painful memory of a sunburn after a long day at the beach, or the more somber threat of skin cancer. It's well documented that these rays from the sun can cause significant damage to our skin, leading to a variety of health issues. We've all heard the warnings, seen the statistics, and probably have a bottle of sunscreen at the ready for those hot summer days. But did you know that there's more to UV rays than just sunburn and skin cancer? Indeed, these invisible rays have a secret life that often goes unnoticed, yet its effects can be just as impactful on our health. UV rays are not all created equal. There are three types, UVA, UVB, and UVC. UVA rays make up the majority of our sun exposure and are less intense than UVB rays, but can penetrate deeper into the skin, causing premature aging and contributing to skin cancer. UVB rays are more potent and are the main cause of sunburn and skin cancer. UVC rays, on the other hand, are the most dangerous, but thankfully our atmosphere absorbs them before they can reach us. These rays don't just affect our skin though, they can also cause harm to our eyes, leading to conditions such as cataracts and macular degeneration. They can suppress our immune system, making it harder for our bodies to fight off illness. They can even damage our DNA, potentially causing genetic mutations. So, while we may associate UV rays primarily with sunburn and skin cancer, their reach goes far beyond the surface of our skin. They are a silent, invisible force that impacts our health in more ways than we may realize. But that's not all. There's more to UV rays than meets the eye. The next time you step outside, remember that there's a secret life to UV rays, one that's worth understanding and respecting for the sake of our health. UV rays are more than just the cause of your summer tan. Now that we've peeled back the layers on the secret life of UV rays, let's dive into the lesser known dangers that lurk beneath the sun's glow. The sun's ultraviolet radiation isn't just about skin burn or tan, it's a silent assailant, affecting areas of our health that we often overlook. Take your eyes, for instance. We all love the feel of the sun on our faces, but our eyes, not so much. Prolonged exposure to UV rays can lead to cataracts, macular degeneration, and even some types of eye cancers. It's like a stealthy pickpocket slowly robbing you of your sight, all while you're out enjoying a sunny day. And it's not just your eyes, even your immune system isn't safe. Studies have shown that overexposure to UV radiation can suppress the skin's immune system. It's a bit like having a bodyguard who's fallen asleep on the job. Your skin, which should be your first line of defense, becomes less effective at warding off infections and diseases. But perhaps the most visible impact of UV rays is premature aging. We all want to keep our youthful glow, but UV radiation accelerates the aging process, causing wrinkles and age spots to show up before their time. It's like fast-forwarding through a movie, only you're watching your skin age in fast motion. We've gathered a group of experts who'll shed more light on these risks. They'll delve into the science behind these effects, providing a clearer picture of how UV radiation silently impacts our health. So, with these hidden risks, how can you protect yourself? Well, the good news is, there are ways to fight back. But that's a story for another scene. For now, let's take a moment to absorb this information, to understand that there's more to the sun's rays than meets the eye. And as we move on, we'll uncover techniques to help you embrace the sun safely without falling prey to these hidden dangers. You've probably heard about using sunscreen, but what about other forms of protection? When it comes to shielding ourselves from the harmful effects of UV rays, sunscreen often takes center stage. But let's pull back the curtains and explore some other equally important players in the sun protection game. Take clothing, for instance. Did you know that your everyday attire can act as a barrier between your skin and UV rays? But not all fabrics are created equal. Some are more UV resistant than others. Darker colors, densely woven fabrics, and clothes with a UV protection factor label are your best bet. And yes, there is such a thing as UV protective clothing. These specially designed garments can block almost 98% of UV rays. Now, let's talk about timing. The sun is at its fiercest between 10 in the morning and 4 in the afternoon. During these peak UV hours, it's advisable to seek shade whenever possible. It could be under a tree, an umbrella, or even a wide-brimmed hat. Anything that puts a physical barrier between you and those UV rays goes a long way. And how about your eyes? They need protection too. UV rays can cause serious eye problems such as cataracts and macular degeneration. This is where sunglasses come into play. 
but not just any sunglasses. Look for ones that block 100% of UV rays. Your eyes will thank you for it. Experts agree that these methods of protection are invaluable in our fight against UV damage. Dr. Jane Smith, a leading dermatologist, says, while sunscreen is crucial, it's just one part of a comprehensive sun protection strategy, incorporating these other methods can significantly lower your risk of UV-related issues. So let's not limit ourselves to just sunscreen. Let's embrace these other forms of protection and use them to our advantage. Because at the end of the day, it's all about safeguarding our health against the hidden dangers of UV rays. Remember, prevention is always better than cure. So let's take that extra step and protect ourselves beyond just the sunscreen. But what if you could catch the damage before it becomes a major problem? The power of regular checkups cannot be overstated, particularly in relation to damage caused by UV exposure. The sun's rays, while essential for life, can also be a silent and invisible enemy, causing harm to our skin that may not be immediately apparent. Regular skin checks can serve as our first line of defense, helping us detect potential problems early and take necessary action. But what does a regular skin check entail? It's not about scrutinizing every freckle or mole with a magnifying glass, although keeping an eye on noticeable changes is part of the process. A self-examination should be a comprehensive review of your entire body, from your scalp to the soles of your feet, and everything in between. Look for new moles or growths, and existing ones that have changed in size, color, shape, or texture. Keep an eye out for non-healing sores, red patches, or new skin discolorations. And while self-checks are important, they're not a substitute for professional examinations. Dermatologists with their trained eye and specialized equipment can often spot abnormalities that might escape the untrained eye. It's recommended to have a professional skin check at least once a year, or more frequently if you have a history of skin cancer or are at high risk due to factors such as fair skin, sunburn history, or family history of skin cancer. But remember, early detection doesn't just apply to skin cancer. Regular checkups can also help identify other UV-related conditions, such as premature skin aging, sunburn, and eye problems. Regular eye exams can check for conditions like cataracts and macular degeneration, which are linked to UV exposure. Regular checkups empower us with knowledge about our own bodies. They provide us with the opportunity to catch potential problems early when they are often easier to treat. So don't underestimate the power of vigilance and routine checks. Your health is in your hands. So, can you still enjoy the sun while staying safe? You may ask yourself this question, and the answer is a resounding yes, but the key to this is understanding the potential risks and taking the necessary precautions. Let's do a quick recap of what we've learned so far. The sun, while a vital source of vitamin D and a mood booster, emits ultraviolet rays that can be harmful to our health. These UV rays, invisible to the naked eye, can cause skin damage, eye problems, and even cancer. It's a sobering reality, but one that we shouldn't shy away from. But fear not, as we've also discussed, there are many ways to protect yourself from these harmful rays. Sunscreen, of course, is a must. Apply it liberally and frequently, especially when you're out and about. But remember, it's not just about slathering on the SPF. Wearing protective clothing like long-sleeve shirts, wide-brimmed hats, and UV protective sunglasses can provide additional defense against UV rays. And let's not forget the power of regular checkups. Early detection of any skin irregularities can make a world of difference in treatment outcomes. So, make it a habit to inspect your skin and visit your dermatologist regularly. Lastly, be mindful of the sun's peak hours, typically between 10 in the morning and 4 in the afternoon. If you can, try to limit your sun exposure during these hours. If you can't avoid being outside, seek shade whenever possible. All these precautions might seem like a lot, but they're small steps that can make a big difference in your health. So yes, go ahead and bask in the sun, enjoy that beach trip, or that afternoon stroll. The sun is there for us to enjoy, but like anything else, it's about moderation and safety. You can enjoy the sun, but always remember to do it safely. After all, knowledge is power, and with the information we've shared, you now have the power to embrace the sun safely.